McGraw-Hill Education MHE is a learning science company and one of the big 3 educational publishers that provides customized educational content, software, and services for pre-K through postgraduate education. The company also provides reference and trade publications for the medical, business, and engineering professions. McGraw-Hill Education currently operates in 28 countries, has more than 5,000 employees globally, and offers products and services to over 135 countries in 60-plus languages. Formerly a division of the McGraw-Hill Companies, now S&P Global, McGraw-Hill Education was divested from McGraw-Hill Financial and acquired by Apollo Global Management in March 2013 for $2.4 billion in cash. Based on the growing demand for classroom technology, McGraw-Hill Education has transitioned from a print-based business model to one based on delivering digital content and technology-enabled learning solutions. This shift has accelerated in recent years with an increased focus on developing adaptive learning systems that enable classroom teaching to come closer to a one-to-one -one student teacher interaction. These systems allow personalized learning by assessing each student's skill level and using data to determine how each can progress through lessons most effectively. McGraw-Hill Education provides digital products and services to over 11 million users. In 2013, the company acquired the Alex Corporation and after acquiring 20% equity stake in Area 9 APS went on to acquire the company, its development partner on the LearnSmart Advantage suite. In 2015 MHE opened a new R&D office in Boston's Innovation District. In September 2016 the company acquired Adaptive Learning Technology and content provider Redbird Learning. The company currently offers over 1,500 adaptive products in higher education and digital formats for its major K-12 programs. <laughs> Corporate history McGraw-Hill Education traces its history back to 1888 when James H. McGraw, co-founder of the company, purchased the American Journal of Railway Appliances. He continued to add further publications, eventually establishing the McGraw Publishing Company in 1899. His co-founder, John A. Hill, had also produced several technical and trade publications and in 1902 formed his own business, the Hill Publishing Company. In 1909 both men agreed upon an alliance and combined the book departments of their publishing companies into the McGraw-Hill Book Company. John Hill served as president, with James McGraw as vice president. 1917 saw the merger of the remaining parts of each business into the McGraw-Hill Publishing Company, Inc. In 1986, McGraw-Hill bought out competitor The Economy Company, then the nation's largest publisher of educational material. The buyout made McGraw-Hill the largest educational publisher in the U.S. In 1979 McGraw-Hill Publishing Company purchased Byte from its owner, publisher Virginia Williamson who then became a vice president of McGraw-Hill. In 1988 McGraw-Hill closed its trade book division. McGraw-Hill Publishing Company, Inc. became the McGraw-Hill Companies in 1995, as part of a corporate identity rebranding. In 2004, the McGraw-Hill Companies sold its children's publishing unit to school specialty. In 2007, the McGraw-Hill Companies launched an online student study network, Gradaguru.com. This offering gave McGraw-Hill an opportunity to connect directly with its end users, the students. The site closed on April 29, 2012. On October 3, 2011, Scripps announced it was purchasing all seven television stations owned by the McGraw-Hill Company's broadcasting division McGraw-Hill Broadcasting for $212 million. The sale is a result of McGraw-Hill's decision to exit the broadcasting industry to focus on its other core properties, including its publishing unit. This deal was approved by the FTC on October 31 and the FCC on November 29. The deal was completed on December 30, 2011. On November 26, 2012, the McGraw Hill Companies announced it was selling its entire education division to Apollo Global Management for $2.5 billion. On March 22, 2013, it announced it had completed the sale and the proceeds were for $2.4 billion in cash. In 2014, McGraw Hill Education India partnered with Gray Campus to promote online learning courses among University Grants Commission National Eligibility Test Aspirants. McGraw Hill Education India is located in Noida area of Delhi, NCR. The company also sells books online at www.mheducation.co.in. 
On June 30, 2015, McGraw-Hill Education announced that Data Recognition Corporation (DRC) had agreed to acquire key assets of the CTB McGraw-Hill assessment business. On May 11, 2017, McGraw-Hill Education announced the sale of the business holdings of McGraw-Hill Ryerson Ryerson Press to Canadian educational publisher Nelson. Corporate organization Operating segments of McGraw-Hill Education include McGraw-Hill Education K-12, which develops curriculum solutions and content for early childhood education, K-12 learners, and adult education. McGraw-Hill Education Higher Ed, which focuses on post-secondary education. McGraw-Hill Education Professional, focused on postgraduate and professional learners. McGraw-Hill Education International, which focuses on learners and professionals outside of the United States, other major subsidiaries, partners and investments. Alex Area 9 APs In grade Key Curriculum StudySync McGraw-Hill Education is also established in Asia, Australia, Canada as McGraw-Hill Ryerson Europe, India, and Latin America as McGraw-Hill Interamericana. In 2013, McGraw-Hill Education acquired the entirety of shares in Tata McGraw-Hill Education Private Limited, the company's long-existing joint venture with Tata Group in India. The company is now known as McGraw-Hill Education in India as well. Topic acquisitions During the course of its history, the McGraw-Hill companies expanded significantly through acquisition, not just within the publishing industry but also into other areas such as financial services the purchase of Standard and Poor's in 1966 and broadcasting the 1972 acquisition of Time Life Broadcasting. Many of these acquisitions stayed with McGraw-Hill Education after their acquisition by Apollo Global Management in 2013. Topic. Presidents John A. Hill 1909 James H. McGraw 1917 Jonathan Heflin 1928 James McGraw, Jr. 1948 Curtis W. McGraw 1950 Donald C. McGraw, 1953 to 1968; Shelton Fisher, 1968 to 1974; Harold McGraw Jr., 1974 to 1983; Joseph Dion, 1983 to 1998; Harold W. McGraw III, 1998 to 2013; Buzz Waterhouse, 2013-2014; David Levin, 2014 to 2017. Buzz Waterhouse 2017-2018 Dr. Nana Banerjee 2018 current Topic Controversies In 1980, McGraw-Hill Education paid the African-American writer and civil rights activist James Baldwin a $200,000 advance for his unfinished book Remember This House, a memoir of his personal recollections of civil rights leaders Medgar Evers, Malcolm X and Martin Luther King Jr. Following his death, the company sued his estate to recover the advance they had paid him for the unfinished book. The lawsuit was dropped by the company in 1990, citing a desire not to cause distress to Baldwin's family. In October 2015, McGraw-Hill Education was accused of whitewashing history after it had published a caption in a geography textbook referring to American slaves as workers. The company quickly apologized, updated the digital version of the materials, and offered schools replacement texts at no charge. Since the controversy began in Houston, it has been linked to broader controversies about conservative texts at the Texas Education Agency. Topic see also S&P Global Educational Publishing Companies Pearson Education Houghton Mifflin Harcourt Scholastic Corporation Google for Education Discovery Education Books in the United States <laughs>